Hi, this is the news for Tuesday, October 18, 2016. I'm Ella Robertson. And I'm Kenzie Starling. And this is VMS News. All members of the Beta Club will have a meeting after school today. Quidditch has been moved to this Thursday, October 20th from 2.45 to 4 o'clock p.m. We will meet in the library and then travel to the practice football field to play our first Quidditch match. Everyone is invited to participate, even if you haven't been to any of our previous meetings. FCA meets tomorrow morning in Ms. Price's room. Members of the Viking Teens Read Book Club, this is a reminder that your t-shirt money is due to Ms. Winstead by this Friday. The VMS Creative Writing Club, under the direction of Ms. Oakley, will begin meeting next Tuesday, October 25th. Where? In Ms. Oakley's room, of course. The time is 2.30 to 3.30. Our garden club is in desperate need of plastic pots to use for gardening. If you have any plastic pots not in use at your house, please ask your parents to think about donating them to VMS Garden Club. Please bring your plastic pot donations to Ms. Bay's for extra try points. Need a part-time job? Coach Smith is now accepting application forms for a paid student position working in the concession stand during basketball games. You must have a good work ethic, be able to be present for all the home games, and have transportation to and from the games. If you wish to apply for this job, please see Ms. Bays for an application and a parent permission and commitment form. Interviews will begin during 7th period on Thursday, October 20th. An application for employment must be turned into Ms. Bays the morning of the 20th. Grades matter for this position. There are no string band meetings today or next week due to the theater class practice. Here's Jason Christ with sports. Girls basketball will practice from 5 till 8 this week. There will be a parents meeting tonight at 5.30. All parents of players are encouraged to attend. Cross country, just a reminder, your uniforms need to be cleaned and turned into Miss Leonard as soon as possible. There will be a tennis meeting after school on Thursday, October 20th in the library from 2.30 until 2.45. If you are planning to play this spring, you must attend this meeting. The girls soccer team will go to Just Jump on Thursday, October 20th, immediately after school. All uniforms must be turned in on that day and all waiver forms must be completed before Thursday or you will not be allowed to jump. Remember, Thursday in the cafeteria immediately after school with uniforms and waivers in hand. Here is News Around the Area with Grayson Phipps. Hi, I'm Grayson Phipps with News Around the Area. The Giver based on the novel by Lewis Lowry is now being performed at the Barter Theater. The Giver won the 1994 Newbery Medal and has sold more than 10 million copies worldwide as of 2014. Bays Mountain Park is always a great draw for visitors seeking the crisp, cool air of fall and the vibrant colors of the season. The peak time to view the fall colors is this week and next. So get out and enjoy the great leaf colors before they're gone. It only happens once a year. Well, that's it for News Around the Area. I'm Grayson Fifth. Back to Ella and Kenzie. That's it for today. I'm Ella Robertson. And I'm Kenzie Starling. Thanks. And thanks for tuning in.